Ladies and gents, welcome, welcome. We're back here today. It is August the 31st, 2019. It's a very big day for us wrestling fans in the world. And I'm no well. You've caught me on a day I'm not feeling very well. It's not very good. Literally, listen, a couple of days ago, I posted a channel update. I said in that channel update, you know, videos every day. I'm really good at sticking to a routine at the minute. I'm going to keep it up. Let me get to days like this. I'm not feeling up to it whatsoever. I'm not feeling up to anything. I don't know what it is. It's a bit of a cold, I think. My nose or the sinuses here and stuff. My throat. It's no good. But it's fine. We're here. Do you know why I'm here, though? Not only because do I love all of you and I love this and I love doing videos and stuff, but also because I love Fozzy. Fozzy have just released a new song. It's called Nowhere to Run. It's from their upcoming album that comes out probably next year in 2020. 2020? That seems ages away. It's just it's next year. <gasps> mm. Loads of water. If you're not feeling well, if you do you know what? Any time of the day, no matter what mood you're feeling in, what condition you're in, loads of water. But when you're not feeling well, extra water is needed. Right, here we go. This is my first reaction of hearing Fozzie's Nowhere to Run. Big Fozzie fan. I first discovered them obviously through Chris Jericho and stuff through the wrestling, but um also the first album I heard was Chasing the Grail. Back in around 2010 sort of time when I fell in love with Martin No More and Watch Me Shine. Watch Me Shine is one of the most underrated metal songs I've ever heard. And then as time goes on, I was becoming more and more of a fan. Do You Want to Start a War was the first time I pre-ordered one of their albums. And then of course Judas is the one that just exploded everything. And I think it's one of my favourite albums of all time, being Judas. Just an amazing album. And now, here we go. The next one that's coming out very soon. This is the first single. It's called Nowhere to Run by Fozzy. Let's check it out right now. Whoa! Different. Oh, it's got that classic forty sound about it. Yep. Oh. Yeah! Hey! Jericho tweeted that it's a grower, as if it's meant to grow on you, but I already like it. Sounds great. That bit right there. That's the fuzzy sound. Yeah! Love it. Classic Fozzy, it's a wee bit of a new spin on things, a new wee twist. Catchy as well, very good. That's cool. Got some classic Rich Ward guitars in there. Oh. Nice. Oh, those Jericho vocals. I like it, I really like it. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's made me feel better, not gonna lie. That's another, that's SOS. I love Fozzie's version of SOS. Wait, wait. That's better. Listen to that. I love this mess came out. Brilliant. I remember when that first came out, he played it on Talkers Jericho. And he I don't know what it was, but the way he was saying ABBA, he was kind of like with his accent and stuff, he was like, ABBA. And I just didn't click that it was ABBA that we all know. And then they played the SOS and I was like, oh my God, a metal version of SOS. Anyway, let's talk about Nowhere to Run. I love it. It's like a... It's a good, I don't know if it's the opening track of the new album, like Judas was or whatever, but it's a great opening track. It's a good one to introduce you to the new sort of um, the new phase of Fozzy, I guess, the new album of Fozzy. So from the last album, my favourite ones were Judas, Drinking with Jesus, Elevator was great, Three Days in Jail was great, Painless, of course, 
all the really creative videos and stuff. Um, I just love that album so much and I'm hoping that, because I think every Fozzie album has gotten better as we've gone on. You know, I loved Enemy, Enemy is kind of like the one that introduced everybody to Fozzie. Um, and I still listen to that song to this day. I actually, about a year ago maybe, when I was getting kind of pumped up to do a play, I was, I was acting in a play. I was getting pumped up and I made a playlist and stuff of songs. I had like Enter Sandman on there, Creed to Overcome. Um, Rolling by Limp Bizkit, like the songs that really got me, you know, excited. And I put Enemy on there and it worked, it was great. It was one of those pure, um, get you hyped up songs sort of things. So Enemy was the, the was the catalyst. And then as I said, obviously Chasing the Grail happened and I loved those those songs on there. I loved Days, Days of the Week. I was going to say, um, Days and Confused, but it's not that, it's Days of the Week from one of the earlier albums. I loved that one as well. Sin and Bones, I think. No, it's not from Sin and Bones, it's from uh, the other album. The one that uh, Nameless Faceless is on with Miles Kennedy. Love that song as well. I, I didn't even click that it was Miles Kennedy until he said it. Just through, you know, listening to, to Jericho interviews and stuff. But yeah, I love Fozzy. Uh, I can't wait for the new album to come out. Do You Want to Start a War? That album is great as well. Lights Go Out, Do You Want to Start a War? This one, SOS. And then we have this Nowhere to Run song, which apparently is going to grow on you, but I already like it. I don't know what he's going on about. It's, it's, it's a classic Fozzy song. It's a good introduction. It's got a new spin to it. It's everything you can want as a Fozzy fan, looking for a new song. So I'm going to go and lie down, because I'm not very well, I've got some temperature. And um, yeah, so it's August 31st on recorded date, so that means we have NXT UK TakeOver Cardiff tonight. We have AEW All Out, Jericho could win the first AEW World Championship tonight. We've got a New Japan show in London. We've got CM Punk at StarCast. These are the days that you live for as a wrestling fan. I tweeted that exact verbiage there earlier on on my Twitter, at CM42TV and also at CM42TV on Instagram. Subscribe here on YouTube for more. Like the video, let me know what you thought of the Fozzy single. What's your favourite Fozzy song? What you thought of this video? And I'll be back very soon with some more Fozzy reactions, but also some more videos in general. Thanks everybody for watching. Apologies for the condition. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Peace.